A moment ago, we mentioned those protests in Russia against Prime Minister Vladimir Putin. Now one of Russia's, Russia's richest men is ready to run against him in next year's presidential election. And for the story on that, we return to Charlie Daggett in Moscow. Well, this may be a name that's more recognizable to NBA fans in the United States. NBA, or excuse me, New Jersey Jets owner Mikhail uh, Prokhorov has put his name into the hat. The billionaire bachelor was the subject of a 60 Minutes interview last December. For me, life and business in particular is a big game. If you could afford to do anything, would you do this? And hire a production company to put it to music? How about this? Maybe not. But Mikhail Prokhorov is always looking for a challenge. You like danger? I like to control risk. Control risk. Yeah. By now, you have probably guessed that Russia's wealthiest citizen and largest individual taxpayer is an adrenaline junkie. He is also one of the country's most avid sportsmen, a former owner of a Moscow basketball team that won the European Championship. You will also notice that he is quite tall, six foot eight to be exact, as he trains here with his personal kickboxing partner, who is also the coach of the Russian national team. I am addicted to sport. Uh, without sport, I feel bad. In this case, uh, it's, a, it's some kind of a drug. How much time do you spend working out every day? Uh, two hours. Whatever happened, two hours, uh, I, uh, I have my workout. Reduces stress? I like to be in stress. You like it? It's my competitive advantage. Now, Prokhorov announced his candidacy last night, and everybody was shocked, including journalists who are supposed to know these things before they're announced. Uh, cynics have said this is just a ploy to take some of the steam off uh, Vladimir Putin. Is he a serious contender? Only time will tell. Jeff and Rebecca? All right. Thank you to CBS's Charlie Daggett in Moscow.